Here we are with the Tekken Titan Season 4, Part 2, Episode 8. And yeah, last episode, we had Armin being out of plans, wanting to stop Kony to save Falco, for Gabi to use them basically as, as an option to get Reiner and the Car Titan, the Peak, to join them in the fight against Eren, right? Because otherwise, if Falco dies, they might be enemies, right? So, that's the thing, any told her our told us our backstory or her backstory and block taking over again for Aaron so yeah will be interesting to see what happens next um and yeah Hanji also making contact with uh Peak and Magath or whatever his name is to maybe try to form an to form a alliance that they work together against Aaron or something so yeah we will see but yeah, if you like what you see, leave a like, subscribe, or comment, let me know what you think. And I would say, let's get to the episode. Who's this? Oliver. Malayne? No? Anji? Anji. She's killing them all. Damn. Yeah, I wonder how long it takes for him to recover from this, right? I would say it would take a long time after sustaining such damage. Zeke is not a problem anymore. And yeah, she also got the message. There he is. <coughs> Did he only sustain damage to his face? It looks like he only sustained damage to his face. And his fingers. Okay. So I guess he is gone. Mm hmm. <clears throat> oh, that's what he did, maybe.
But I mean, he doesn't need Deke anymore, right? Because Ymir granted his wish or whatever. <clears throat> I'm wondering, does he even need Titan uh, Royal Blood anymore? Because he basically freed Ymir's mindset of being a slave, I guess. So that Ymir has a free will and could do what she wants. And that would maybe be to help Aaron grant his wish for power or whatever. But maybe he still needs the royal blood. I don't know. It's weird as fuck. <laughs> But yeah, it looked like as if Zeke got like obliterated by by Aaron. So I guess he's gone. Man, I'm very conflicted when it comes to like who to side with. Do I side with Aaron and his goal? Which is Pretty much bad, right? It's evil, basically killing everyone on the uh, on the whole planet on Earth, um, outside of the outside of Paradise Island. Or do I side with the ones that are against him? I'm conflicted. <laughs> Who to side with? Damn! Look at those asses. <laughs> And now it's rumbling again. Can you even sleep when it's like rumbling the whole time? I guess she can sleep. And he can sleep. Well, in her mouth, I would say. I mean, I guess she wouldn't do it because she wouldn't have a mother that is a titan. You want to feed me, bitch? I know what you want to do. They have the same eye color. Brother, it's been so long. Mm. 
Fucking Nanny. Just get on the ladder and I throw you in. Can't Armin threaten him? Like, hey, if you feed him to your mother, then I just transform into the Colossal Titan and just kill her immediately. Haha. <laughs> so you lose her anyways. Ha <laughs> ha Would be fucked up, but it would work, I guess. Oh, he wants to beat her. Nah, he's not doing it. Now kiss. <laughs> no lunch for her, I guess. Well, beat her, I guess. <laughs> Who would that be? Malaynes? Oh, she has a scarf of her. Okay. Because you have my scarf, bitch. Give it to me. <laughs> Damn. Oh, she just walks away. <laughs> I 
The bells of freedom, they rumble. Oh, the genie is behind him. Is he behind him like backstabby type at some point? <clears throat> yeah, genius is maybe there to get some backstab out of it maybe. Or maybe he really wants to be there. Is this Ani next to him? Yep. By coincidence. Oh, really? Oh, Gene, too. I feel like there's. There are just so many questions about Yelene still. No, they just kill her. Really? Yelena. Will Z, uh, will Jean really do it? Oh, okay. Uh. 
<laughs> yeah, of course. <clears throat> I'm confused. All right. <clears throat> so Gene was not behind them. He was plotting, scheming with Mikasa and others. And that's the instructor. How did they get into contact with them? Honey? Mm hmm He thinks he's in some weird reality. Or maybe not. Fighting Aaron. Man, this episode went by in a flash, it feels like. Holy shit. Okay, that was the episode. Um, yeah, I'm a bit confused. Gene said he got into contact with Melaine last night. How? I mean, it feels like... I mean, we don't know when exactly Hachi, uh, Hanji, made contact with them, right? So we don't know when that point was exactly. Um, but for me, it seemed like that they just made contact, and so I'm confused how they could make contact that quickly with the others, right? So that's a bit confusing, like, that it happened so quickly, out of nowhere. Um, but yeah, so yeah, Gene wasn't with Flock to actually work with them. Yeah, obviously Gene is like... He wants to save the world basically now, right? Because of all the dead people and all that stuff. And not just sit around and do nothing and let Aaron kill everybody. Um because that would wait on his conscience, I get I guess. And yeah. Now we have like I guess our group that will fight Aaron. Which is Connie, Armin, Mikasa, Reiner. Gabi Falco, I mean, they, I guess, wouldn't be a big help because they're still kids and only Falco has a Titan, which he can't control, probably. Uh, Hanji, well, more or less Levi, I guess, the car Titan, who is not really good for combat and they don't have a cannon to strap on him, I guess, right? And I guess <clears throat> Levi might also not be a big help. 
but it seems like Levi is only like hurt in his face, right? It seems like he has only like wounds on his face, but nowhere else. His upper, his torso looked fine. Um, so yeah, still wonder how long he will take to recover. I guess before the anime ends, he will be ready to fight again. But I would imagine that shouldn't take too long, right? Like time-wise, I mean, it still takes months before the final, 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 final season comes out, right? And but like in times of the world, right? It shouldn't take that much time before the end, right? Because Aaron is on his way to Malane. That takes maybe a few days to cross the sea, right? To Malane, <clears throat> and then it shouldn't take long before it ends because either. It get they kill Eren pretty quickly, right, and stop him. Or the longer it takes, the more he can just go across the world and just kill everyone, right? Um, so yeah, that will be interesting. But yeah, like I said, because it shouldn't take that much time in the world, I can't see how Levi can recover quickly from this. It, Unless he has like some super recovery as Ackerman, who knows, right? Because I mean, when we remember when he broke his leg when he fought Ani as a female titan, he broke his leg or like maybe didn't broke it, but like he hurt his leg and he was like not able to do anything for quite some time, right? So now having like his face hurt, which impacts his vision and all that stuff, he lost two fingers and who knows what else is. What, what what other wounds he has, right? I would imagine that takes way longer to heal, right? So, yeah. Should be out of commission for even longer, I would imagine. But I guess not. We will see. But yeah, otherwise, yeah, we have our group that wants to fight Aaron, I guess. And we have Locke and some others that are like behind Aaron. That be Aaron. And I guess the one girl that wants to be like Mikasa is just gonna die, I guess, because she has a sh shrapnel in her in her stomach, and no one can do anything about it. And yeah, I guess that's it, basically, right? I mean, the Malanes wanted to get Yelena, right? I feel like there's still more to know about her because she seems like such a weird character, right? I mean. Sure, she joined Zeke because he wanted to save them, the home country, right? Um, but we don't know much else about her, right? Why she is so weird? Because she seems very weird. And yeah, Zeke seems like he's dead now. Which was to be expected, I guess, because we didn't saw him for a few episodes. So I guess he's dead, right? Otherwise, they would show him that he's fine or whatever. And yeah, we will see who else might join, right? I mean, I guess we have all the main characters together right now, right? I mean, Flock is the main character, but he's like on Eren's side. But I mean, like all characters, all the main characters that are against Eren basically are now together, I think, of those that are left. So we will see who else will maybe join them. Because there might be maybe some people in the military that will join them. Because just a few of them against like all the colossal titans and Eren and the whole military police on the island. If it's just those few, I would say I I can't believe that they can do much about it. Right? It it seems just that they're completely outclassed, outmatched, outnumbered. Right? So we will see how that goes. But yeah. If you like what you saw, leave a like, subscribe, or comment, let me know what you think, and I would say thanks for watching, until next time, bye-bye.